Hey everybody, Professor Cynical back again with another glitch video. Now, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to get all of those juicy freighter modules. I'm going to show you where to get them and how to use them. And of course, I'm going to show you how to glitch them using a very well established and very, very, very good glitch. And on to make the process extremely easy and painless and as quick as possible so you can get on unlocking all of those juicy upgrades all right so the very first place you want to be is in space and you want to hunt down those normal freighters that are in a big group and they're just pan around into space obviously that not your own and then you want to start attacking now normally you want to look for modules outside of the ship and if you notice on the top right there once you start deleting those modules by absolutely blowing them up is what i mean by deleting because as you can see i'm using my uh my very lovely god tier ship so it is virtually deleting them because of how much power this thing has anyway i digress basically you want to start attacking all of these ships now you're looking for those freighter modules now i would say one out of every 10 to 15 ships you attack would drop a module so you will have to take a little bit of punishment so it is very 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 important that a you choose a ship that can stand quite a bit of damage because you will get attacked as well by other ships in the area and you want to make sure that your ship can do a lot of damage at the same time so that you can make this procedure as quick and as painless as possible for you so go ahead start attacking ships and keep an eye top right and keep on checking your inventory keep on checking your exosuit inventory as well depending on where your cargo does go and just keep looking out for those juicy freighter modules and once you do you want to get the heck out of dodge you really want to get out of there because otherwise nine times out of ten you'll probably lose it because you will get blown up <laughs> and especially playing survival so definitely get yourself out of there once you have got one of those modules now luckily for me i already had the anomaly called relatively close to where i was attacking all of these freighters however if you're not as fortunate as that all you need to do is start flying away and eventually your warp drive will be unlocked all you need to do then is just warp just for five ten seconds just out of the area that should be enough then for you to call in the anomaly and now we're gonna just go ahead land the anomaly as normal you don't need to do a fly through for this glitch you just need to go into the anomaly and land so i've gone ahead here and just sped up this part of the footage so what you want to do is why you're kind of flying through or when you land it's completely up to yourself is you want to get to your personal refiner empty it out of any item that's already in there like i've just done and look for your brand new salvage freight modules now i didn't realize i actually collected three i thought oh, i only collected like one or two but never mind three is a good place to start once you found them place them into your personal refiner now we are going to be doing the personal refiner duplication glitch however you want to have around about 60 modules duplicated and that will be to ensure that everything gets unlocked now this is a very well established glitch already now i do understand that a lot of you guys watching this here today will completely know how to do this particular glitch however this part of the video is mainly aimed for those newer players that have only just got Norman Sky and are unlocking the freighter side of things for the first time. So the way that you do this glitch, if you are one of the newer members to our awesome Norman Sky community, then I'll just very quickly run over it one more time for you, is you want to put an item that you want to duplicate, i.e. our salvaged uh, freighter data, put that into your personal refiner, jump in your ship jump out your ship now that will create an auto save once that's created you want to pull the data back out into your personal refiner again if you're not catching any of this guys don't worry just pause the videos at every other point and you'll kind of see slowly how it works so once you pull the stuff back out you want to then go and transfer an item over to a player now it can be any item that you want however if you do have a decent item that you don't mind giving away give that away first that's what i always suggest because you are going to be inconveniencing somebody else by obviously giving them an item that technically they probably don't want so give them a decent item try and make their day as well and then what you want to do is reload your raw or save now when you reload your auto save it'll bring you back right back next to your ship and if you go into your exosuit you should see 
the item and again if you go then back into your personal refiner you should see the item again and that has therefore been duplicated and it's just a case of rinse and repeat put the items back all the items that is so from the exo suit and the ones that are already in your personal refiner back in that'll double it up and then you do the cycle again and you do that as many times as it takes to then get all the items that you need to then go to your freighter and unlock all of those juicy goodies all right guys so i've gone ahead and i've just landed on my freighter now after duping everything that i wanted to duplicate now we're on the same page now so we all know how to do the duplication glitch so what you want to do is when you're on your freighter you want to run now to the command room now it should be the big room right in front yeah it's got the big glowing ball of a planet I am a little guy swinging around. You've got your captain up on the brig there at the top. Fantastic. You want to go to this central column here. And look at that. Now with all of those modules that we've just duplicated, we can now get this virtually this entire thing unlocked literally for five minutes of your time whereas normally you'd have to go hunting for those massive massive freighters you know and be attacked a thousand times probably die the same amount of times as well this way then just makes it so much easier get in get out get everything duplicated and then get everything unlocked now i do realize in this footage i didn't heed my own advice and i did only duplicate a very small number of frigate modules which is why i was trying to sell you in this video and this narration you're gonna need more <laughs> because for my own stupidity i didn't listen to future me over doing this comment because i cannot see into the future and you know yeah I, I, I didn't do enough but you guys should do enough do as i said not as i do all right guys i want to thank my wonderful patrons for today's video frank cheeto jerry richard Bo, jeff the dread sky captain z1420 mr dreads and our newest member geeky96 thank you very much to each and every one of you for your continued support to the channel if you the viewer are watching this here today i want to support my work and you like what i do you can click on the patreon link down in the video description below or there is a wee icon at the end of this video you can click on that it'll take you over to my patreon page now i hope that this video has been extremely helpful for you especially if you're the newer player and that's everything from me here today as always my name is professor cynical and i'll catch you all again in the next one bye for now